Have you ever found yourself lost in the vast jungle of financial advice, not knowing which way to turn? I've been there too. In fact, I've ventured through a whopping 100 books on money matters to uncover some real pearls of wisdom. Whether you're a seasoned financial guru or just starting your journey, these secrets I've unearthed might just be the missing pieces to your financial puzzle. I'm excited to reveal 10 incredibly impactful lessons that could truly revolutionize how you perceive money, from making it work for you to securing your financial future. So let's embark on this enlightening journey through these invaluable money secrets. And hey, while you're at it, hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up to never miss out on more valuable insights for mastering your money game. Number one, the magic of compounding gains. Compound interest is like a magic money machine. Imagine putting your money in a special piggy bank that not only grows, but also makes even more money by itself. Here's the trick. When you invest some money and it earns a profit, that profit also starts making money for you. It's like having a snowball that rolls down a hill, getting bigger and faster as it goes. The earlier you start this money-making adventure, the better. Why? Because time is super important here. Even if you start with a small amount, if you give it lots of time, it can turn into a really big amount. Let's say you invest $100. It might not seem like much, but if you let it grow over many years, that $100 can become a whole lot more. And guess what's even cooler? As your money grows, the money it makes for you also grows, creating a cycle of more and more money. It's like building a tower with Lego blocks. The taller it gets, the easier it is to add more blocks. This magic doesn't only work with money in a bank. It also works if you buy bonds that make money over time or if you own a business that keeps growing and reinvesting its profits. This is how people become super rich, by using the power of compound interest to make their money grow and grow and grow. Number two, leveraging cash flowing assets. You know how sometimes you might have something that brings in money for you without you having to work for it? Like when you lend a game to a friend who pays you a bit to use it? Well, there are ways to invest in things that do that on a larger scale. These investments, like owning a house that someone pays to live in, or having a part of a company that regularly pays its investors, create a stream of income without you having to do much. When you get this money, you can use it to buy more of these income-making things. This helps your wealth grow because as you gather more of these investments, they make even more money for you. It's like a snowball rolling downhill, getting bigger and picking up more wealth as it goes. Number three, balancing offense and defense in personal finance. The millionaire next door delves into the intricacies of wealth accumulation, emphasizing the dual importance of earning and saving. While increasing one's income is essential, the book underscores the critical role of prudent expense management and debt avoidance in accelerating the process of wealth accumulation. The core idea revolves around finding a balance between earning more and spending less, considering this variance as the cornerstone of financial success. This approach highlights that consistently spending beyond one's means leads to financial instability, and impedes the journey toward accumulating wealth. Therefore, the book stresses the significance of not just generating income, but also being mindful of how it's managed and saved to foster long-term financial security and affluence. Number four, decoupling time from earning. Imagine you have a lemonade stand. When you're there selling cups, you make money, but only while you're actively pouring and serving. Trading time for money is like that. You earn when you're working. Now, think of owning a vending machine instead. Once you set it up and stock it, people buy drinks, and you earn money without being there all the time. That's closer to passive income, earning without constantly working. Financial gurus talk about this because it's like creating a system, a machine, or investing in things that generate money without you needing to be there every second. 
It's about finding ways to make your money work for you, so you're not tied to trading hours for dollars. This way, you could earn while you sleep or enjoy life rather than being stuck in a cycle of trading time for money. Number 5. Grasping the Impact of Inflation Inflation is a bit like a slow and steady rise in prices over time. Imagine your favorite snacks getting more expensive every year. This means the money you have today might not buy the same amount of snacks in the future. To keep your money from losing its value, it's important to invest it wisely. Books like A Random Walk Down Wall Street suggest putting your money into things that grow faster than inflation. That could be stuff like houses or stocks that tend to increase in value over time. The thing about money is that its value goes down slowly over time. It's like a battery losing power bit by bit. So, to stay ahead, your money needs to grow faster than it's losing value. This becomes crucial, especially when you think about retirement. The money you've saved up might not be enough to buy the same things when you retire because prices would have gone up. So, having investments that outpace rising prices becomes really important. Sometimes, salaries don't increase as fast as prices do, which means your paycheck might not keep up with the rising costs of things. This is why it's essential to have investments that can beat inflation. They act as a shield, helping you maintain the same buying power or even increase it in the future. In short, inflation slowly eats away at the value of your money, and to combat that, You've got to make sure your money grows faster than prices do. Number 6. Distinguishing Assets from Liabilities In Rich Dad, Poor Dad, Robert Kiyosaki breaks down the path to financial success by distinguishing between assets and liabilities. According to Kiyosaki, assets are the key to growing wealth as they put money in your pocket like rental properties or stocks that generate income. On the flip side, Liabilities take money out, such as loans, mortgages, or unnecessary debts. His philosophy centers on accumulating income-generating assets while minimizing liabilities that drain resources. Kiyosaki stresses the importance of understanding the true cost of debt, highlighting that not all debt is bad. Good debt can be associated with investments that appreciate or generate income, while bad debt often involves unnecessary expenses or high-interest consumer loans. Ultimately, he underscores that assets build wealth through appreciation or cash flow, while liabilities with their payments, interest, and depreciation can diminish your financial well-being. To achieve financial prosperity, Kiyosaki advocates for a focus on acquiring assets and minimizing liabilities guiding individuals to make informed decisions regarding debt and directing resources toward investments that foster wealth growth over time. Number 7. Prioritizing Discipline Over Knowledge in Finance Authors like Benjamin Graham and Morgan Housel emphasize a crucial aspect often overlooked in managing finances and investments. Behavior holds more weight than technical knowledge. Their insights underscore the paramount importance of disciplined behavior over mere knowledge. This behavior entails steering clear of impulsive decisions, maintaining a budget, and staying committed to a disciplined investment approach, especially when facing market downturns. Graham and Housel stress that the core of personal finance boils down to the self-discipline of spending less than what you earn advocating for controlled impulses to achieve financial stability. In the realm of investing, they highlight the significance of not just developing a strategy, but sticking to it diligently over the long term, resisting emotional reactions to market fluctuations. Interestingly, they note that while many individuals possess an understanding of prudent financial practices, the real challenge lies in implementing this knowledge consistently. Thus, they emphasize the need for cultivating disciplined behavior as the linchpin of financial success, transcending the mere possession of financial knowledge. Number 8. 
Unraveling the Influence of Taxes Taxes play a substantial role in wealth management, often eroding the potential gains from investments. Books like The Boglehead's Guide to Investing emphasize the critical aspect of tax-efficient investing as a means to maximize returns after taxes. Understanding and utilizing tax-advantaged accounts and strategies can significantly enhance the after-tax profitability of your investments. Tax-efficient investing involves strategies aimed at reducing the impact of taxes on investment returns. One of the primary ways to achieve this is by leveraging tax-advantaged accounts like IRAs, Individual Retirement Accounts, or 401, KS, which offer tax benefits such as tax-deferred growth or tax-free withdrawals in the case of Roth accounts. These accounts allow your investments to grow without being taxed each year, thereby magnifying your overall gains over time. Moreover, certain investment strategies like choosing investments with lower turnover rates or favoring investments that generate qualified dividends or long-term capital gains can also help minimize tax liabilities. By strategically aligning investments within tax-efficient accounts and employing investment vehicles that incur lower taxes, investors can potentially retain a larger portion of their gains. Taxes represent a significant expense for most people, and minimizing the tax burden is crucial in preserving and growing wealth. Being mindful of the tax implications of financial decisions is essential. It's not just about how much you earn from your investments, but also about how much you get to keep after taxes. Carefully considering the tax consequences before making investment moves can have a profound impact on the overall return on investment. In essence, the focus on tax-efficient investing underscores the importance of strategically utilizing tax-advantaged accounts and employing investment strategies that help mitigate tax implications. By doing so, investors can optimize their after-tax returns, allowing their investments to work more effectively toward building and preserving wealth over the long term. Number 9. Understand the Wealth-Building Power of Business Ownership the concept of owning a business as a means of building wealth is extensively discussed in numerous books, notably within the biography of Warren Buffett and various other entrepreneurial guides. The allure of business ownership extends far beyond mere income and tax advantages. It offers a unique combination of scalability, potential for substantial profits, and the creation of lasting value. Many of the world's millionaires and billionaires attribute their wealth primarily to their equity ownership in businesses they either started or significantly contributed to. One of the most compelling aspects of owning a business is its scalability. Unlike traditional employment where income growth might be limited, successful businesses can be scaled up significantly, leading to exponential growth in earnings. This scalability is driven by the ability to expand operations, reach wider markets, and increase profitability, thereby creating an opportunity for substantial wealth accumulation. Furthermore, business ownership provides the potential for remarkable profits, particularly during the sale or exit of the business. A successful exit strategy whether through selling the business or going public, can result in significant financial gains, often far surpassing the income generated during the operational phase. This creates an avenue for a liquidity event that can generate substantial wealth for the business owner. Equity ownership in a thriving business stands as one of the most potent means of building wealth. Unlike other assets, a successful company has the potential to generate substantial cash flow, making it an ultimate asset in the wealth-building journey. Businesses, when well-managed and structured efficiently, can continuously produce income and appreciation, fueling the growth of wealth over time. In summary, the profound impact of owning a business on wealth-building is highlighted by its potential for scalability substantial profits upon sale, 
and the creation of a cash-flowing asset. Entrepreneurs and business leaders often emphasize the transformative power of a successful business as the key driver behind their wealth accumulation, making it a cornerstone in the pursuit of financial prosperity and enduring wealth. Number 10. Risk and Uncertainty Must be accepted for opportunities to be seized. Nassim Nicholas Taleb's books, The Black Swan and Fooled by Randomness, explore the concepts of risk, uncertainty, and the unexpected. In the world of investments, risk is inherent. It's the possibility of losses. However, embracing calculated risks means understanding and managing these uncertainties. By doing so, investors can position themselves to seize potential opportunities for financial gain. Essentially, it's about being prepared for setbacks while leveraging risks intelligently to achieve rewards. In the realm of finance and investment, many prefer safe choices due to a fear of loss. This cautious approach, while seemingly protective, often means missing out on potential growth opportunities. Recognizing and accepting risk and uncertainty is pivotal in this landscape. Opportunities for growth are inherently tied to uncertainty. Ventures with potential gains also carry the risk of failure. Balancing risk and reward is fundamental. Higher potential returns usually accompany higher risks. Stepping beyond the comfort zone is where personal and financial growth truly flourishes, fostering adaptability and refined decision-making. Looking at the successes of renowned figures like Warren Buffett and Elon Musk reinforces the idea that embracing uncertainty is crucial for uncovering lucrative opportunities. It's not about recklessness, but about understanding and mitigating risks, preparing for downsides while making informed choices. Embracing risk isn't avoiding it. It's about mastering it to unveil a world of untapped potential in financial decisions. This shift in perspective challenges conventional wisdom, paving the way for transformative financial strategies. I recommend you watch the next video in our series. Don't hesitate to share this video, subscribe to our channel, and share your thoughts in the comments section.